A couple of days ago, I made a pretty dumb mess up. I'll be the first one to admit it, and I'm not very happy about it, but I'm here to correct that wrong. A couple of days ago, I had actually made a review over this strain right here by JK Distro. Under the assumption of something different, uh, definitely my fault for not just looking a little bit more. Um, I thought this was the purple label strain and saying that this was $275 an ounce. I was actually, in fact, very, very wrong. Um, even though this looks very purple, it is not the purple label. This was um, just a regular label. I thought that this was going to be coming out during the week. It doesn't matter. I fucked up. My bad. I am here to right that wrong. So today, this is not $275 an ounce. This is actually a lot cheaper. In fact, it is so cheap that an eighth of this actually cost $14 right now. That is a big jump from $275. I believe the ounce is like $190, something close to that area. Um, shout out to the people that watched the video to begin with. I'm not gonna give you guys the same exact video. That's actually really fucked up in my opinion. Right here, as you guys will see on uh, some video popping up, we have a different kind of joint skis. Um, we took the Keef that they have, which they also are having crazy sales over that. Purple Milk Keef, uh, which you guys should go watch that video, it seems to be doing pretty good. We also use some of their concentrate on sale. And right here, we have what the OG Urban Remo would call it, a supercharged joint. We've got some Keef in here, we've got some concentrate. All that's left to do is literally just spark this bitch up, man. We are still using the same strain though, the Georgie Pie or Georgia Pie. Cheers. Yes, I could have just easily uh, changed the title of the last video or just done whatever, but it just didn't sit right with me, you know? If you're gonna do it, at least do it right. So right here we do have a supercharged joint of the Georgie Pie. $14 an eighth, really big jump from 275. Now in my uh, last preview or review of this, if you didn't see it, I overall said that I thought that it was still a pretty good strain. I actually think it still tastes very good. And for $14 an eighth is way better than 275 a fucking zip. Yeah, we, have, we also have the purple milk keef in here. And then I think we literally just have a Butter or something? Batter? Yeah, batter. Yeah, it's the first time I've ever messed up on something like that. I mean, I'll just be completely honest. And it's a pretty big mess up, like I said. I mean, I could have easily just kept the video up or whatever, but I would much rather redo it. Um, I didn't put too much concentrate in here. Uh, I did put a good amount of keef. It was hard to do. You'll see the video. It was hard to do with like one hand and a camera. So sorry if it's not the best uh, video. But yeah, when uh, whenever I found out and then it, you know I was like, oh my god, it's a fourteen dollar eighth compared to. I was like, bro, I felt so stupid, man. I definitely, the whole day yesterday, just felt pretty stupid, I'm not gonna lie. Coming in at 34% too, by the way. So $14 for 34% is fucking crazy. I also saw that some of you guys asked to show the flower. I did forget on that as well. I just fucked up all around um, on that video, I guess. So that will be more towards the end of the video. For those who wonder or are ever wondering, I always uh, put the footage of the flower if I can remember it because yeah, sometimes I fucking forget like I'm a normal human being You know what I mean? Like I'm not perfect and I literally smoke weed like what the fuck? Of course my memory is not the best all the time, but um, Generally, you know, that's the cool thing what cool thing with video uh, making and all that stuff is realistically you can sit on you know a video and remember stuff, but <sighs> Me personally I don't really have too many videos that I sit on. I generally try to like make stuff, like I might sit on it for like a couple of days or whatever, but I'm not sitting on anything from like months ago. I can definitely taste the keef in there, man. The purple keef has a pretty interestingly piney, uh, cushy kind of taste. Literally just looks like a jar of sand, but that jar of sand would obliterate most people with just a little bowl, you know? In the video that I made talking about it, this is generally how I like to use it is just put it in flour and you know add some concentrate and you have a crazy freaking joint man a supercharged joint Happy New Year's everybody it's time right now to smoke a huge supercharged joint if you guys don't know who Urban Remo is you definitely need to go check him out 
He's uh, literally one of the OG WeTubers. Uh, he was around when like Custom Grow 420, like all of them were like, and you know, Josh and all of them obviously. They were all at the top and uh, Urban, Remo's from, uh, Urban Remo's from Canada. He literally sells nutrients for growing. It's, it's very, very cool. Very, very cool guy. Well, I don't know him. I guess I'm just fucking, sound like I'm a parasocial, I'm being parasocial, but I'm not. Like I've, I think he still makes content. Like definitely go check him out. So now the question is, do I think that this is worth it for $14 an eighth? 100%. <laughs> uh, do I still think it's worth it for like, I think it's still like 190 an ounce, which is still pretty expensive if you ask me, especially when you uh, think about the fact that they have $50 ounces and uh, I think they're even doing fucking $42 ounces. I know they're having a crazy deal. Uh, Cause yeah, just cool company like that. So like, I'm not even halfway and I'm obviously already ridiculously baked because I already know I went past the one uh, batter and I put most of the keef like right here. I always like to like essentially put uh, like the most in the middle or not the most, like you gotta evenly distribute it so it's not super uneven or like pregnant or whatever, but I like to put a good, or, a, a better amount in the middle just because that's usually when I like to stop like hitting it for some reason. I've, I've told you guys before, it's almost like an internal clock when I, um, you know, usually I'm smoking by myself. Like, I don't really like to smoke a whole joint. I usually just can't um, because like, especially right now, sitting here in silence, essentially just talking to myself, um, you definitely just start to like zone out and be like, but uh, this, uh, this Keef is very, very packed. Like I was worried about it being more like fine because it's a, uh, you know, it, I've, I've had some that is really fine and this is a uh, more like sand, honestly. It essentially feels more like kind of like hash than keef, which I'm pretty sure they do take keef to make hash. So it's like, you know what I mean? It's just like almost like a mid process of hash essentially. Literally all this shit is on sale and like together this is probably a fucking like 50% you know, joint that I just made myself very easily and could make multiple of like beautiful man it's a very beautiful thing but then we're gonna go in here um yeah so i fucked up that's my bad uh had to get it right uh, appreciate your uh support and uh thank you for being patient with me i appreciate it man this shit is uh fucking crazy overall way worth it now more in my opinion even better now that i know it's cheaper and uh yeah i'm super big bro anyway if you guys enjoy the end bumps send your own to chili dilly end bumps uh fucking love you guys and uh please make sure to like the video again i know you watched it again but it's pretty much different Love you guys.